Clarkie, quite a quick recovery for you. You were back out there today in our scratch match versus the Suns. Yeah, yeah, so I think um, three weeks on the dot today and um, yeah, obviously uh, being in a full-time environment in a hub and having access to the physios and the docs every day and the strength and conditioning guys has um, been a big player in that and um, yeah, obviously a short, short recovery, but also um, yeah, thankful for to be able to be back out here and playing footy. How did you feel out there? Did it feel like you hadn't missed that much time at all? Uh, let's just say I think I'll be better for the run. Um, at some points, yeah, I just needed a good blowout and um, I got that out there today. Obviously, there's a few different factors than there was in Perth. Obviously, a bit the heat over here and um, obviously um, a bit more contested than we've been used to. We had 18 on 18 for most of today and usually we've been playing about 12, 13, 14 players. So um, a bit more contested and uh, I think a few boys uh, will be better for this run. We ran into quite an experienced Suns lineup, and they really showed us a few things today. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, credit to them. Um, they looked like they'd um, been training really well, and um, just like we just spoke about in the dress then, they'd probably been they're a bit more match ready than we were. So um, yeah, and we addressed that and said that that's probably something we need to work on in the uh, coming weeks to make sure if a few of us get called up, we're ready to go for the ones. Alongside yourself, there were some other cats that made their return today. Josh Jenkins was one of those. One of the first real looks we had at him today. Yeah, yeah, it was obviously great to have JJ out there, some experience for the young boys and um, obviously really good at setting the ground up. Um, he's come in and he knows what's going on and um, helps those young forwards out quite a lot and um, obviously it's just nice to have a big man to kick the ball to and um, yeah, I thought he was really solid today and um, it's just it's great to have him at the club. Quinton Narkel was another one of those, we saw him back out there running through the midfield. Yeah, no, it's obviously Narks is a very skillful player and it's great to have him back in, in the midfield as well, um, obviously he loves the contested ball and um, loves winning a few clearances here and there and um, spoke to him before and he felt um, the same way as I did. Had a little bit of a blow and um, so at times it was hard to get in the game but just had to work our way into it. So um, yeah, I think we'll both be, like I said before, better for the run. Some pretty big hits out there today from Nakai Cockatoo. Looks like he was laying some really strong tackles. Yeah, obviously um, Cocky is, um, everyone knows what he's capable of and um, he's quite a big body to have around the contest. So. Um, yeah, and that's what we expect from Cocky to lay some big tackles and um, really set the tone and um, that's what he's been starting to do over the last couple of weeks and he's building nicely. Any other boys out there today that caught your eye? Yeah, I suppose everyone had a red hot crack today and um, I'd say Francis Evans was really good from the young boys, obviously Coop, um, Cam Tahani, really solid as well um, and obviously saw some good things out of um, big Sammy De Koning in the ruck. Um, he uh, doesn't usually play in the ruck, but um, he's been a bloke for us. He's been able to go wherever the coach needs him or we as a team need him, and um, I think he's adapting really well. The last few weeks at AFL level have really shown there's a lot of players not that far away from selection, and you can really go in and make an impact. How much, how encouraging is that for you boys playing at this second level? Yeah, that's it, and um, yeah, spots are quite um, hotly contested at the moment, and um, you just got to make sure that when you get your opportunity, you got to take it, and um, that's a credit to the boys who have gone in so far, and um, obviously the development staff here at the club have been able to play a hand in that. Cheers, Jordan, and well done on the quick recovery. No worries, thanks, Dave.